Hi, it's me again with Krill Roll Tips and Tricks. This is part three of this and hopefully the last. I stated that it would maybe find a better way to bring the numbers in equally. So we're going to take the Smart Fill tool. We're going to fill that in. Let's see what our nudge factor is. Let's make it just a half of an inch. 0.5. And let's nudge that up and actually nudge it over. Now, if we take our two and hold down the shifts and select our yellow box and then go EC, it put it into the center of that. I'm going to, I should have put my order, put my yellow to the back of, well, I need to take the yellow to the back of page. So our two shows. But now that we got that, we can take our two and nudge it back. Okay. Now we, we, did three, uh, 180 divided by 31, which is a uh, pretty weird, uh, not an even divisible. So it's 5.8. So I took that number. I'm going to right click and I'm going to copy it. And then I'm going to take my two and I'm going to double click and put the rotation there. And I'm going to rotate it that number. And I've had enter it, puts it on the next deal, but we actually need to go it all the way over here. So let's back up here and we need to move it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13 spots. So if we take our number and put in that, I'm going to right click and paste that number in and then times 13. Well, it should have been times 14. Um, so paste that number in times 14. Now the next three is just going to be exactly the same. Just put it there and see so by moving that, I think it's better because um, you can see if it jumps or not or anything. So let's just take the three and then shift select the box and go C E R E C and then grab our number and put it down, double click on it. I'm trying to figure out a way if you could make them all uh, rotate from the, without having to move this every time. Now we're gonna do the same number divided by, or times uh, 12. Well, I'm sorry, should have been 13. So that number, and if you had that kind of written down somewhere, uh, times 13. And it's going to put it right in that number. And just keep doing that all the way around. And just, you know, just remember that this was spot one, two, and three. So every time that number is going to get less and less. Let's do it one more time to see if I can't get better. So shift select the box, E, C, or C, E. <clears throat> Take the number and move it down. Double click on it. Move the center rotation in the center. A lot of times if you just get close, it'll do it. Take that number times 12. I didn't do it. Paste times 12. There we go. And it worked. So just, and that, it's a little bit, you know, there's, I wish the numbers were all single digits and then you could just have them rotate around. But when you get it to the 31, uh, it's a little bit different animal and you know, it doesn't fit in there perfectly. You know, like a single digit number would be. I'm still going to work on it. See if I can make it easier, but I don't know. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.